Hey peeps, I am back with another video. It's your girl Ember Charmaine. You already know the name. If you don't, make sure you subscribe so you can get to know me through all my videos. And today, we are gonna get into this wig, this synthetic wig, babe. Be. If you, so we're gonna be reviewing this wig. It came in this, so this is just the packaging. So these are all the components that came with the wig. So this is like a little description right there. Here is the bag that it came in right here. And it says Dashley Fast Fashion Meets Hair. Um, this wig was $39.99. I think I got like 10% off of it for some reason in store. I did buy this local in Columbus, Ohio. So just see if they have this in your local beauty supply store. I don't know if you can shop online. I will double check and try to remember to put that in the video or in the description. Um, but it is also the color Money Piece Wine, which I will show you guys in just a second. And then it's just this that is around it so here is the wig right here it is this cute little bob and i thought this would be so perfect going into the fall like this is so cute y'all like wait <laughs> i cannot wait to cut this lace off i've been dying to put this wig on y'all i've had this wig for a minute but i've been waiting to film for y'all for you right there looking at me and I'm so excited to put this on so I did also buy this it's the medium brown ebon New York tinted lace aerosol spray skin tone medium brown so I'm gonna go ahead and spray this on this is my first time using a lace tint y'all so um, but first I do want to show y'all the inside of the wig and the lace so the lace is actually quite wide as you can see i feel like it goes like from ear to ear the lace is pretty thin it definitely is not a natural color especially for someone that is brown and then here is the inside of the wig it does have two combs on the sides and then it does have a comb on the bottom and it is adjustable so let me show y'all the adjustable straps So I'm gonna go ahead and move that to the tightest one because my head is really small. So boom, it's on there. Go ahead and do this other one, boom. And I hope that was a good look for you guys of the wig. And that is everything for the inside of the wig. So let's go ahead and put this on. So this is what it looks like. The lace is not cut. Y'all, I feel so sophisticated, so cute. Also, I did already wash this wig and the hair flips held up. And that's what I was nervous about with washing it. Just because of the pandemic and everything, I wanted to make sure I washed it no matter what, but I was scared that I would waste my money if these flips did not come back. But the flips are here. This is synthetic hair. I was in the store um, physically a couple weeks ago buying this wig and the lady did tell me that you can use heat on this hair so that is good to know as well just in case the flips did come out that was something that i made sure i knew just in case because i i was worried about that from the jump because i knew i would wash it since i was buying it in store in the middle of a pandemic and in general you should wash your wigs before you put them on these flips are it for me let me know what you think cuz <laughs> what <laughs> I'm through like <laughs> girl period also on this little like card that they have it does say safe up to 350 400 Fahrenheit so the lady told me right and it's right on here it does say this has baby hair which i have not noticed as of yet that there are like shorter pieces to mimic baby hair i haven't really seen that but in general i think it's going to be just fine with or without it um i mean i bought it so it's going to have to be fine with or without it so yeah i think that's everything as far as like the specifics i think the hair feels so good like no hair is shedding nothing's coming out um, nothing came out when I washed it either. Um, it didn't really have any smell to it before I washed it. Um, and now it smells like perfectly fine because I washed it with my shampoo that I already, you know, like and know what it smells like. 
um my hands are running through it just fine um the actual like lace really is not natural as i mentioned when i showed y'all the close-up so let's go ahead and see what happens when we do this lace tint because hopefully it doesn't ruin it because that'll be tragic so let me make sure i can show y'all this oh my gosh do i need lace tint oh i just need it on the part because all the rest of it is black so let's see what happens when i put this right here on the part And I'm just trying to like swivel this around to do like more jagged lines and nothing like too straight so it doesn't look like super fake. I'm gonna go ahead and put the combs in and if you guys can already tell i have baby hair already like laid down so oh my god <sighs> am i giving bombshell am i giving i feel like i'm giving victoria's secret model hair like wait what i'm an angel period i'm a victoria's secret angel okay the lip gloss is in the way that was a bad idea <laughs> okay so i just wanted to bring y'all a little bit closer so y'all could see like i am so happy about this wig like oh this is such a good everyday wig it's so easy to put on there's not a lot to it it's short it's not gonna be in your way like y'all i do not feel like this looks bad at all like i feel like this looks really good and this is a synthetic wig like that's so crazy like if this was human hair that's the only thing that could make it any better is if it actually was human hair and like had like better lace that melted better that's the only thing that can make this wig any better but in general it's like it doesn't need to be human and it doesn't have to have better lace because look at this look at this and then my baby hairs aren't showing that much they're just kind of peeking through y'all would have to be super close up to see them but they're just peeking through so it does actually help it give a more natural look you can see the baby hair right there so it kind of like peeks through just a little bit or like if the wind would blow you'll see some of the baby hair so that is actually everything i have to say to y'all about this wig like could you believe it i am so glad this is the best like 30 40 dollars i've spent on some hair some synthetic hair so once again y'all so y'all know the brand it is dashley lace unit 11 money piece hazel oh my gosh okay y'all so they had to give me like a different box to have this go in so the thing that i was reading off of that it went in is actually the wrong thing but this is actually the color so it's money piece hazel that makes more sense this isn't wine this isn't a red this is um a like faded like blonde deep blonde type of color so that's what this is so money piece hazel makes way more sense so who who oh girl stop playing with me hey i love this okay y'all i'm gonna stop talking and rambling because we get the picture i'm in love where's the ring <laughs> but i'm gonna go ahead and get out of here i will see you all in the next video thank you so much for watching don't forget to thumbs up this video especially if you like this wig you like the review or you're going to buy it make sure you hit that thumbs up button subscribe comment down below and let me know how you feel about it and also share this video with somebody else that will enjoy it or you know needs a wig like this oh kurt i will see you all in the next one peace